Hello, here is a video of a trip to Svakopmund, which is a funny German-influenced town here. We had a great time and I managed to film a couple of interesting interviews. Check it out. After a very tiny trip in the tiniest minibus ever, we have finally arrived at the South Atlantic Ocean. Show me your war face! <laughs> Show me your war face! <laughs> oi, oi, oi! Svakopmund is a weird place. It's a ghost town with German architecture and everything looks like it's out of place, just planted here in the middle of nothing. What kind of Africa is this supposed to be? There's all kinds of German cakes and pastries here. This is weird, this is very absurd. Anyways, now me and Eva and Suomi Aija and Konstantin and Lukas, we're going to the beach where we have some beers with us and we're going to walk the shore till the sun sets. That there is the South Atlantic Ocean. And behind me there are, there are dunes. It's the Namib Desert. The first ever dunes I've seen. I love oceans. It makes you feel so small and so tiny. And then again it makes the world feel so Huge. Wow, it just looks like... I don't know. Yeah, next time you do that with your own beer, <laughs> yeah? Hey, why does Swagopun have so much German influence? Because it used to be a German uh, a colony, but uh, Svakopmund always used to be the most German town yeah. in, 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 in Namibia. And today they're working on this a bit because if you a tourist from overseas, you mm. come through the Namib desert, yeah. you all of a sudden you see this little German town. Yeah. It's a curious, you know? It's very, it's very, it's, strange, it's bizarre. Yeah, yeah, it's bizarre. Uh, yeah. And, um, it, it's it's a weird. Doesn't fit really. No, no. no. It, and this is. Do you um, also I feel like that? Play, and the people yeah. play a little bit on that. You know? oh, it's yeah? a surprise. Uh, <laughs> yeah. I get it. I haven't got my reading glasses, oh. but if I look here, yeah, yeah, yeah. Really, that is So where, this is where it's where all it started, started from. Yeah, that is at take eight. And Swakopmund is here. Swakopmund here, and later, um, the German uh, traders who came here, they needed protection. It's not. They don't didn't ride it colonial force. Yeah. It's shoots to the protection uh, for the America. for the and that merchants. is how it started in uh, eighteen eighty four down there. Whatever yeah. uh, building material, yeah. it was not building material. It had got to come from Germany. Yeah. It had to be uh, shipped in from Germany, you know. And whatever mm. they needed in winter for building houses came by boat to Stuttgart and. Yeah. And this here quite interesting. Hmm. This is a post runner when the boats arrived. A post runner? Yeah. He ran with those this post back to winter. It took him fourteen days. Right. And we mustn't forget in those years there were leopards and lions around. Oh. Sometimes oh. one oh. of them didn't arrive for the post, <laughs> you know. Thank you for sharing the stories. Pleasure. Yeah. Pleasure. All right. Pleasure. Yeah. Thank you so much. Right. 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 Oh. That was, okay. Yeah. Thank, thank you. you. Bye bye. One more thing I found very, very fascinating that I want to point out is that even the walls at the surrounding the houses are much much lower. They surely don't prevent anybody from getting in. Like this house behind me. And they do have a dog there, they do have a watchdog, but it's a cute one. Even the dogs are less scary and less wild here. And as you can see, there's nobody on the streets. Except for Suomi Aija. Torilla Tavata! All in all, Svakopmund seems like a lot safer place than Windhoek. Yesterday we were walking along the beach um, till it got dark. And, th and that is something I would never do in Windhoek because all, all the locals have told me to stay away from the streets after um, after the sunset. So here I asked the 
local Swako moon people if it's any safer or as dangerous as Windhoek and they said that it's totally fine to walk anywhere at any time and I I can feel that <laughs> even this car driver gave me a thumbs up now we're on our way to what's it called the tiger reef bar which is like a sunset bar and down it goes Oi! to life to life to be life <laughs> And what kind of Germans are there here, mostly? Here, I think it's typical German families and they want to make some desert tours with a 4x4 and um, yeah, it's like a status symbol. Do you feel proud that this is German territory? This used to be German territory. I'm not proud. I think they are proud, I think they are all proud. So yeah. That's why we are doing this. This is now the Marine Denkmal. It's made uh, at uh, 1903 for the fallen German soldiers. Right. For the, for the militaries they have done here. Okay. Most of these people, do they consider Swabakmund and uh, Namibia um, German territory or Namibia or like part of Germany? Or? We are staying together and make peace together. Ah. We even include our locals, our authorities, as you have yeah. seen on, on, on the front of the blacks, everybody are welcome. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So it's it's actually freedom for all. I'm feeling much better here than in Germany. Why is that? Oh, the peoples are more flexible. Yeah. The country are much bigger and the spaces and the attitude are correct. Yeah, okay. They're quite hmm. different. Hmm. All right, thank you. Pleasure. Have a nice day. Find out it's, it's a home from home. Yeah. So when uh, when the German they are here, they are feeling so comfortable because we are so friendly people, and then uh, yeah. we make a friendship or yeah. kind of stuff. But do you some do you sometimes get a feeling like Germans are still trying to colonize this <laughs> city? Or <laughs> <laughs> not really. <laughs> not really. <laughs> so we forgive. Yeah. So we are we are not. Uh, Turning back again, we are just uh, going forward. Yeah. So, is there any problems between the Germans and uh, uh, and then the? Apparently, we don't have a problem with them. Yeah. We are just like brother and sister. Yeah. We are, when we meet, we used to laugh to each other, yeah. so make a friendship. So we. Right. So we drink a coffee together. We, there's no problem with them. Ah, this car. That's it for now. Um, I am getting some contacts here, so I've got some plans for the future. Anyways, thanks for watching and see you next time.